Hi guys, welcome back to the Edinburgh Reacts. This is a supplementary episode and uh, Ed now is going to explain why we've done an extra episode this week. So, over to you, Ed. Hi, right. This is a... Uh, well, it was a quest. Um, it's, uh, it's for Roger. This is for Roger and Wendy. They know who they are, Roger and Wendy. And I was asked to do... Um, a, it was a request to do a, a, a song by a guy called Mark Martell. Now, it's new to me. I don't know who he was, so we've Googled him and got him up. And he's a, a singer. And it was basically, he's, he's like, close your eyes and it's Freddie Mercury. I mean, I know there's a lot of Freddie impersonators out there, mm. but they get close. I mean, even the guy that did it, uh, well, he wasn't really a impersonator, the, the Lambert guy that did it mm. with Queen. But this guy, yeah, you shut your, this, this guy is the real deal. So it's for Roger and Wendy. This is Mark Martell. And it's a live performance from in Germany. So it's a big show with a band behind him and everything. And he's performing Radio Radio Gaga. Marvellous. So there you go. For Roger and Wendy. Roger, all the best. Um, and it's Radio Gaga by Mark Martell. Marvellous, Ed. Vision. 
machen wir. Yeah. So, what do you think, Ed? I thought I thought it was great. Yeah. <laughs> I see what you mean. Yeah. I mean, that's uncanny. I mean, oh, obviously, it doesn't look like Freddie. Although a few of his movements on stage here were quite reminiscent of Freddie. Oh yeah. But by and large, he, he, did, he was physically he was doing his own thing. Yeah. But I mean, yeah, shut your eyes and listen to him. <laughs> I mean, he even had that vibrato that. It's very synonymous with Freddie. Yeah, it's, you know, very, fast, uh, it's very quick. Yeah. Almost, uh, I don't mean offensively, but almost like a sheep or a goat, you know. Bah, yeah. bah, bah. Like, mm. There's not a lot of singers, they've got more slow, slow like yeah. vibrato. But Freddie had that, and that guy nailed it to the team. Mm. And he said, oh, they're me. Yeah, he did sound to Ted like him. Yeah, but you know what, yeah. I thought, the band were great as well. That show presentation, the whole thing was great, I thought. Mm. Now, I might be going to offend some people here, and I don't give a shit if I do. Because it's, again, it's my reaction. Mm. You know, my opinion. Only my opinion. It's his opinion, yeah. Yeah, because he, he keeps his mouth shut. So mm. I'm the one that gets my ass kicked. No. But I have watched, I never saw it live, but I did uh, watch the last tour that they did. It was, uh, you know, Q, Q, I'm talking about Queen. Mm. They did the world tour and they had that uh, guy, I forget his first name, Lambert. Mm. The guy singing with it at the moment. Yeah, it was, it was great. It was, it was right, good. Yeah. And as I say, he doesn't sound like Freddie, or I don't say he doesn't try to. Well, you shouldn't try to be like Freddie because you won't be. Mm. You'll get in for a get your ass kicked on that one. But dare I say, the, the videos I've watched from the live shows of when the last Queen tour with mm. Lambert, I thought that was better. Oh, God, yeah. I thought that was better. Mm. Yeah. I mean, I can imagine Queen mm. with that guy doing it. Mm. I mean, that, that would be the... That actually went through my head. I wonder if they've seen him and thought, hang on a minute, why, don't, don't, we have, why don't we get this guy in to do some bloody... Yeah, well, I think, with us, yeah. personally, this guy has surfaced after the Lambert guy. Mm. I don't think they were aware of him. No. Because... That, to me, was better. It was better, yeah. Not better than Queen when Freddie was there, but mm. the last, uh, the last sort uh, of uh, resurrection of Queen. Mm. Although I thought George Michael did, did a damn good job, but he didn't try and sound like Well, him. that's right, and he did it as George Michael. Way, and, and Annie Lennox as well. Yeah. They all did their own thing and brought something new to the Queen song. Mm. Mm. And I think that was the idea they did it that mm. way. But... Uh, that I thought was great, it you know, and the whole part. I mean, yeah. everything, everything was great. Everything, yeah. everything was Show. marvelous. The whole thing, yeah, marvelous. Ed, so yeah. I'm glad that was pointed out. So yeah. anyway, Roger, that's for you and Wendy, and uh, you know who you are. So for every every other everyone else that um, that has joined us today, thanks for joining us. Uh, if you want to see any more of this guy, let us know in the comments. Exactly. Let us know what you think, guys. Let us know any other suggestions or whatever. And keep smashing the notification bell. Yeah. Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. In the comments, as Ian says, and mm -hmm. please, please, guys, subscribe. We want to get the subscriptions up. Thanks for the latest, um, for the latest Spires of Coffees. Oh, they really are. Yeah, that, you know who he was. He was. Well, I can't remember the name now, but um, I should remember was the it name. Roger seven three seven. Something like that. Yeah. You know who you are. You know who you are anyway. And, and thank um, you for that guy. Because, yeah, you, you've been uh, in the comments quite a few times. Yeah. And, uh, and you, yeah, very nice. Yeah. We appreciate all the uh, support, guys, because uh, we don't get paid from YouTube for a lot of these videos. Um, they're just, uh, we, we just work to promote them, don't we? Well, that's <laughs> yeah. Yeah, really, yeah, at the moment, yeah. So... Yeah. See you next week, guys, for a normal week of Eddie and Reacts. Ciao for now, guys.